In this video we'll be trying out a new geography game where we fly around with a plane and deliver packages all around the world. So leave a like and don't mind the hair, it is just the result of a charity stream. So let's go. The game is called Geographical Adventures and it is made by Sebastian Like You. I'm sorry if I mispronounced the name. And let's go. The map corresponds to the world, so currently we are over the Europe. This is Italy as you can see. So basically the goal is to travel around and deliver packages. At the top of the screen, we can choose one of the three destinations. Let's choose Ukraine since we are right here. But it's, it's very difficult to understand which, which actually is Ukraine. Is, is this Ukraine? I think this is Ukraine, right? But I don't know where, where that city is. Let, let's go lower so we can, we can see better. And let's deliver it somewhere here. Okay, close enough. 300 kilometers away, so as you can see, I didn't deliver it very well, but I did. At least I delivered it in the right country. Um, let's go for Greece now. I think this is a really cool game to, to teach children geography. It's still a work in progress, according to the developer, but I think it's such a cool, cool way to... Close enough. 91 kilometers is nice. Oh, pretty close. Pretty close. It's it's difficult to to deliver it accurately. Estonia. I have to I have to go for Estonia. I realize I'm only choosing European countries, but I mean I'm from Baltics myself. I have to try to deliver a package to Estonia. Tallinn is here. Close enough. Seventy nine kilometers. Nice. And this game also has a day and night cycle. As you can see, it's getting a little bit dark in here. And once it gets dark, the cities get illuminated. Which is really interesting. Norway is pretty dark. I guess it's because it's uh, full of mountains. But let's now go to Japan. Let's fly over Greenland. Oh my god, Greenland is like a huge chunk of snow and ice. <laughs> this is Alaska. This is Russia, I think. So we should be in Japan very soon. It's very easy to get lost in this game. Because you're looking at the world from a very different angle. And, and, and from a... Different side as well, not necessarily from south to north. Let's go somewhere here. Oh no, I th I, I threw it in the water. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no. Basically, this game is like working for DHL or UPS delivering packages and not not always very precisely. And also, there is another mode we, that we can uh, we can look at the world like this, which probably makes it easier to fly around. To be honest. Wait, is this... Are we in Brazil? Where? No. Where, where are... I have no idea where the hell are we right now. Is this China? Where are... I'm so lost. I've been talking to you guys and... and I have absolutely no idea where the hell am I. Is, is this Papua New Guinea? Oh, we, okay. We are over... We are over Indonesia. Let's deliver it to Papua New Guinea then. So this is Indonesia. Where is Papua New Guinea? Should be somewhere here. Oh, here we're coming close. Port Moresby was... I'm not sure. Somewhere here? Well, not on the mount. Ah, oh, further. Okay. Close enough. Close enough, guys. But yeah, it's, it's a very simple game. Not, not too much of a gameplay, but uh, hopefully developer keeps adding new features because I think it's very promising. And as I mentioned, I think uh, it's a re would be a really cool way to teach children geography very interactive way that that grabs attention is, are, are these philippines a lot of like bunch of islands i think it, they are where zone city was just uh here 129 kilometers oh i i should probably should have uh, gone more more south to make it more precise china jingxi let's go for a challenge i have no idea where jingxi jingxi city is but uh we are right next to China. Wait, oh, so this is China. Um, let's go somewhere here. I have no idea. Literally failed. Oh god. Oh, there was Jingxi City. Oh no. Where the hell did I drop it? <laughs> I dropped it somewhere in the mountains. Okay, cool. Okay, I'm currently over the Middle East. I really like how this game. How the world, the mountains, everything corresponds to, to Earth. Djibouti is somewhere here, right? 
disasters. Ocean? Did I delete alert in ocean? And in case anyone is wondering, it is not possible to crash your plane. If you try to go down, it stops automatically. So this is Brazil. Oh my god, Brazil is so huge. I mean, you, you know Brazil is very big, but when you see it from this angle, just look ev look everywhere around, it's all, all Brazil. Okay, this is... which is Colombia here? That's Peru, this is Colombia, Bogota... So Bogota should be somewhere here. 120 kilometers. Oh, I, I overshot it. Ah, there was Bogota. It would be cool to have a compass to know where you, which way you are going to sort of better understand where exactly you are. But anyway, I, I realize this isn't my usual geography content, but it's still a geography related game and sort of educational. So I thought you might enjoy it. Let me know in the comments what you thought about it and if I should try some other uh, different geography games in the future. But until then, huge thanks to all of the patrons and YouTube members for supporting this channel. I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your day. Be kind to one another and see you in the next video.